Hello everyone and welcome to Rodan Man's Reviews. So today we're going to take a look at the G.I. Joe Classified Series Scarlet from Hasbro. So this is from the new line of G.I. Joe uh, figures that Hasbro is offering. I've already done a couple of reviews of other figures. Uh, so today we're going to take a look at Scarlet. So let's go ahead and take her down from the stand. So really happy, really cool that I uh, that they made a, uh, a figure of Scarlet. I uh, was really, really happy to be able to pick her up. So let's go ahead and take a look at her articulation. So as usual, we get kind of the 90 degree um, arm bend there. As you can see, I think this arm is just a little bit hindered. She's got this and a shoulder pad thing here with a star on it so that hinders a little bit for that arm um, but other than that you know the other side it goes up all the way this side goes up pretty much all the way but not quite we get uh, an ab crunch with Scarlet here we get the head goes from side to side the head looks down head looks up a little bit um, Scarlet suffers from what a lot of figures with um, hair or ponytails or what have you um, suffer from in that the head doesn't look up quite as well, but still does. We still get some movement here with the head. Um, we get the arms are not double jointed, um, but looking at the legs, the legs are double jointed, so we get some good, good movement there with the legs. As far as the feet... Uh, the feet go up a little bit, yeah, pretty well. Feet point down pretty well. Um, we also get a swivel at both, uh, at both hips. So overall, kind of what you would expect from, you know, uh, the, the G.I. Joe classified series ones we've taken a look at so far, or Marvel Legends or what have you. As far as accessories with Scarlet, <clears throat> we do get... Well, a couple things here. So we've got this thing here, which is the uh, quiver that goes around on her back with her her bolts from her from her crossbow. Uh, we get this uh, kind of holster thing here um, for her. We also get the we also get some. Actually, that's not a holster. That's uh, just like a pack or something like that. Forgive me. I, I It's not like a... I thought it was like a holster thing, but it's like... Uh, I don't know. It carries ammo ammo in it or bombs or whatever. <laughs> it's not... But it's not like a, uh, like a holster or anything uh, that I can tell. Yeah, I don't think anything... May, maybe something tucks down in there. I don't think so, though. But... You know, we so we get the like the little bandolier thing. Another thing that I thought was really cool with her is that she gets three knives, man. Girl's got some knives on her. So we have one knife that we can kind of slide up into um, this right here. And then right here on the back of the quiver, we've got a couple of extra knives that you can kind of slide right into the hole. So I'll try and get those a little close without them getting too too blurry here so that's that's what we're looking like and pretty much all the knives kind of look the same I think yeah you know they're pretty much all the same thing but it's cool that she gets you know like one knife would have been cool but the fact that she's got three is is really neat uh, and then we have this um, of course Scarlet wouldn't be Scarlet without her her crossbow um, so we've got that and this thing kind of Kind of pops off pretty easy. Oh, there we go. Okay, so so we've got the crossbow for her. I kind of wish that was one piece. I don't like that that comes apart like that. Um, but once you get it in her hand, you can pose her up pretty good with the crossbow. You know, and so yeah, and she's also got you know as I mentioned in a couple of the other videos. Uh, these newer G.I. Joe figures have these, uh, you know, she's got like the metal, almost like a metal armband thing with you know, 
like these little, I don't know if these are shurikens or little darts or whatever they are on our, on our wrist here. Um, but it's like a metal um, gauntlet or, or armband, you know, it's like the gold going on. Um, she's got it also here on the chest plate where you've got this kind of gold lining going around here and then right there on her chest as well. Um, she's also got it, <clears throat> excuse me, right down here at her on the boots as well as we can see kind of the metal um, with the different colors, the, the yellow, the blue, the red and everything. So a lot of different colors going on on her, um, but overall it works. I like it. As far as details, um, every, uh, everywhere else as far as the paint apps, um, I think overall it works for her. You know, the hair looks cool. Um, I guess maybe if I had a gripe, there could be just a little bit of, you know, they could have put a little bit more detail into the hair, maybe a wash to kind of a, like a different color or something like that in there. Maybe like a, like a little bit of a, just a little bit darker red running through there or something like that. I don't know. Maybe that's just a minor gripe. But overall, I think it's a, it's a pretty cool figure um, of Scarlet. So Scarlet from the G.I. Joe Classified Series from Hasbro. So really interested in checking out more of these figures, um, getting some more of them and, and showing these reviews for you guys. So, um, you know, if there are any that you would like to see, definitely let me know in the comments. As always, uh, guys, thank you for watching. Please like, please comment, please subscribe. And I'll see you all next video.